Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today, we're gonna be building something very special. But before this, for those who are new there, my name is Vincent, and I'm a Quebec video game builder. Before posting this one, I had another one in hell. But actually, when I started to editing, I realized that my idea was actually very bad and that it didn't go as well. So I decided to make another one. So as you have probably read and seen if you follow me on Steam, I'm gonna be building today an elephant sanctuary. I know that I wrote reservation, but <laughs> it's a sanctuary. It's just once I already posted everything that I realized that I wrote the bad thing. So this is how things happen. So yes, I was wandering into the Steam Workshop and when I wrote African Elephant Reservation, African Elephant Sanctuary, we had nothing. And actually it's probably, I guess, the most common animal to put in Sanctuary we have very fabulous and renowned sanctuaries of elephants but we don't have any elephant sanctuaries in the steam workshop we only have enclosure so i wanted to really to make a park with a very large elephant exhibit and very conservatory aspects so this is what we're building today. My idea here was actually to recreate like a migration path of elephants. So with the adults and the youngster, really to try making something very cute. <laughs> So coming to the lights, I tried to light the most I could that place. And then when you will see at one moment, I'm going to put little bulbs on the wall as trying to recreate some stars. That idea, I got it from another YouTuber, more famous than I, <laughs> called, I'm sorry if I misspell your name, uh, Best in Slot. <laughs> and he actually made a full constellation sky i won't do this because i'm too lazy to make it but i'm gonna try to do something very cute with this I like the idea to remind people that they are in a protected zone area, if you prefer, and uh, they can't have whatever they want. They need to do it before to enter. So this is why I made like the last call for a drink or a meal, because they won't have any other once they pass the door.
If you're interested, we have a special one night with Dumbo for $99. At that part, I tried to recreate like a typical African village with the cattle and everything.
I could have allowed my visitor to take a car ride through the enclosure, but I thought it would seem very better if they could walk inside and see outside when they're and compare their size and everything. So what I thought is actually that I made a path almost all around the enclosure so that people may see inside. I also put a fence between them and the elephants. They're a little bit higher than the elephants, but it gives like a very well vision except if you're one of the visitors who actually don't see at two feet from their eyes. But for someone like a player or everything, it's very amazing. And the elephant have plenty of space. And also, they're very intimate. Now time for re-education! Did you know that African elephant can live up to 70 years old? That their population is estimated to 415,000 in Africa. And that their population decreased by 70% since the 80s and even more that maybe in 2040 they'll go instinct Brackeny. this was education time see you in the next episode I'm building a memorial of the fallen elephants fallen elephants who fell during the war for their tusks I also wrote a little poem so get ready
so I'm gone since long That my tusks are your jewels That my bones dried under the sun are now dust You can still hear my trumpet under the umbrella tree and the eternal moon
Thank you guys for watching. See you in my next videos.